Go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go, baby. So first question is for Hector. Go on. Oh. How do you feel when you walk in and see your shirt hanging on the wall? The first time, obviously, was unbelievable. Mm -hmm. I started taking pictures Ooh. and sending them to everyone. I, I think everyone does that. But yeah. now, obviously, uh, the feeling I get it most when I walk into the pitch. On the big screen, when it says like, yeah. 16, Rob Holding, and a picture yeah. of me stood there like that. Yeah. And I see it, I get a little buzz off that. Yeah. Well. My one is just walking down the tunnel. Yeah. That yeah. never changes. Come Which on. one of us would thrive if we played up front? And I know the answer. What do you mean? You know, pace, in behind the defenders. Skill, technique. What do you mean? <laughs> but no understanding. You will need to understand you your yeah. teammate. You yeah. need to un you un so you're not saying me? Who, who did you think, Pear? I think it's obvious. I think I give you a lot more options. I give you hold up play, I give you off the shoulder, aerial play. You don't threat. know where to go. You, you mess it up, you know? You want to yeah, do I, everything. You want right. to do everything. I score the most goals. What about, in the what about my runs in behind the defense? You know, just yeah, kick the ball along the way. No, you're not no. a winger. You're up front. Central. You don't know when to go. Yeah, but I know when to run off. You've got when, I see, when I see Pear lifting his head up. Five out of six times. <laughs> so who yeah. are you saying? Given name, Hector or Rob? Well, you, you, you can't you'd, say Pear. You'd play number nine, not wide. Number nine. I'm just a good target, you know. I always give yourself out there. Very smart. Stretch, I think, I, I think stretch the defense. When you lose in a game and you need to score in the in the last five minutes, then I'll put you up front. I'm on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crouchy baby. Your agent calls to offer you a small speaking role in a film. Do you take it? 100%. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Always said this, yeah. Anything. Throw me out of it. East Enders, yeah, Coronation <laughs> Street. Give me, give me anything. <laughs> Even if it's yeah, like a, a proper like, bad character or something. Um, no, I haven't mind. His little speaking role. Like, Hollywood. Attention. Around action. Just attention. 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 Raise attention. Just attention. Me, Just me, 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 me. That's me, me, me. <laughs> so, Hector. Which of us is most likely to open a restaurant after our retirement? Well, I've got one already, so... Yeah. I've got a few more. Who <laughs> <laughs> my lord, what? Huh? what Spanish or? I've got one in Spain, in Madrid. Have you? Yeah, what yeah. kind of? What kind it's of a tapas? healthy restaurant. Healthy? It's called Angu uh, Romola. Romola. And, the, and the, the slogan is Unguilty Pleasures. Oh, nice. So it's like, Sounds like a bit healthy later. stuff and very tasty <laughs> and stuff like this. So yeah, guys, if you're ever in Madrid, shout out <laughs> <me. laughs> Is it Madrid? Yeah, it's Madrid. Yeah. You can go Barca, no? No, Madrid City Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you become a manager, yeah. would you be tracksuit or tailored suit? Oh, no. Pear is definitely tracksuit. <laughs> tracksuit? You're no. definitely tracksuit. But Pear is a comfy guy, man. Yeah, yeah he's a comfy, comfy guy. He doesn't care about all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What works best. I might need to change, you know. You know, you know they say like the managers with um, with suits, mm. they have better rate win of ratio. win ratio than than, yeah. than managers with tracksuit, yeah. Oh, sure. Crazy, yeah. Go. Yeah, it's true. Pair. Yes. Well, oh, wow. Rob. <laughs> oh, wow. I love Rob. this question. Michael Jordan versus LeBron James, who is the GOAT? Oh my god. <laughs> Who is the GOAT? Oh. oh I love LeBron, man. I, I love know. him, but Kobe. The best <laughs> overall player is LeBron, but the GOAT is Jordan. What's the worst time you thought you gave away a penalty, but the ref didn't call it? Against Watford. Yeah? He saw, he saw a shot, Callum blocked it, and then he come at me and he knocked it, and then like, I just like, didn't have time to react, so I was just like stood there, he just ran into me and jumped on the floor, and I was like, the ref's not going to give that, surely. Ah, yeah. And the ref didn't give it in the end. But I thought, no, please no. Well, my ones, they've given away yeah, they give it. I didn't touch it. Anytime Victor so. touches the guy. <laughs> it's been the other way around. Yeah. <laughs> Who has been the most important person in your career? Oh, my God. It's got to be you, big man. <laughs> <laughs> no, since what? I've, since I've been at Arsenal, like, player-wise, as be fair, yeah. if it comes from, like, being a young lad, it would be your dad. Like, he, yeah, took, yeah. he took me everywhere, so every game, stood in the rain and the snow and stood and watched me. Well, he forced me to play when I was four, you know? Forced him. Yeah, he forced me. <laughs> he was a lot four. Well, you should thank yeah. him now, yeah? Yeah. He forced me to play. What decision he made? I have to say, for me, as a player, you probably have been the... Yeah, that's yeah, what I want to say. You're the most. Experience. Yeah, you, it, you're the dad. Good, you're yeah. the dad. <laughs> you're, the you're the goal, mate. But like, when I'm leaving next season, you know? Yeah, what are you going to do? You need, we'll just text you. You need to step up. We need to step up. Yeah. Step up. Let's go. Um, outside of Messi and Ronaldo, who's the best Who's the player you've had the hardest time defending? I think Coutinho's definitely up there. Yeah? Coutinho was very good, and Aguero. Neymar or Sane. Yeah? yeah Sane. Nice. Mm. Sane is decent, mate. Yeah. Pace. Ronaldinho, Ronaldinho yeah. Great you play at Barca, him, yeah. yeah. Oh. We oh, played no. at Barca. It was <laughs> nice. hilarious, man. Oh, yeah. For Arsenal? <laughs> no, for Bremen. For Bremen. He's 
crazy. <laughs> with the back, he played with the <laughs> back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Silly. It's Long silly. ball, he played the ball with the back. Yeah. He was like, oh, no, it's over. <laughs> <laughs> Are you happy with your jersey number? Uh, if not, what number would you like? I'm not happy. What, what number do you want? My number's 29. Who's got that? Oh, granite. always granite. Granite's got that, hasn't it? But when I came granite here, Shamak had it. Yeah. When you have once the four, you cannot yeah, go yeah, back. Yeah, so 29. So I took Fabregas' number. So. 29. Did you have 29 at Bremen? Yeah, Bremen, Hanover. Really? Everywhere, 29. And I came here, it was occupied. Oh, oh fuming. You should have said, I'm pair. <laughs> <laughs> I want 29. <laughs> number two, is it? It's not occupied. Well, he's not occupied now, but he was at the beginning of the season. season so what happens in the summer? So in the summer, then I want to ask to you. Hey, it's kind of, we have no number one, no number two, no number three, no number five. I've already, I've already spoken to Vic, so five. he knows. What about you? Five. Five, yeah, you yeah, like five. Everything growing up was always five, yeah. five, five. <laughs> When you had coaches that put like a six as centre half, I used to sometimes get a six and I'm no. nah, that's not keep five. Man. Why 29 pair? What's <laughs> the significance? So when you're a young player, you get always normally 30 number. plus. 45, number, 45, yeah, 45 like 30 plus numbers in the first team. So the kit manager of Hanover looked at my birthday and he saw 29 nine. Oh, nice. So, and he gave me the 29. So it was dedicated nice. to me. 29 his. days after me? <laughs> the 20th. Yeah? yeah? So that was special. Yeah. And I thought, yeah, I was a young player, but he gave me under 30, kind of. Yeah, oh, it's unusual, see, under yeah, 30. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's the player in the dressing room who don't want to go against in a dance of... So basically, who's, who's the best dancer? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it always you? Why is it always a focus on you? I don't know, mate. You can do a lot of things. <laughs> Versatile. 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 Yeah. yeah. Ospina's a good dancer. Yeah. Ospina's got, got a salsa, yeah. And stuff like if it's, if it's, if it's yeah. salsa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. is decent. A oh, well, we've got rhythm. Mm. He keeps stiff. 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 He has that yeah. like, stiff rhythm. He has that like, stiff rhythm. Um, you're not bad though. you got like a little bit of Latin music again. Yeah, you're a Latin, bit. Latin, yeah, yeah. that in me. How about you, Phil? What you got? No. Oh. What can you offer? Fist pump. If Jurassic Park was real, would you visit it? I've already said 100%. <laughs> 100%. Yeah, no, 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 you would. <laughs> Got to go there. Yeah. When are you going to see, to see dinosaurs again? Yeah, I'll probably, yeah. I'll probably go there. In the movies, you know what? Yeah, but that's what I've saying this before. If it happened, then there wouldn't be three, four movies. It'd be shut down straight away after the first movie. If it was real. That makes sense, doesn't it? That makes sense. Yeah. So if it's still made four movies, it must be safe, and we'll go and have a great time. Okay. All right. Christmas. Cool, Rob. I'll come with you. Nice, thanks. <laughs> Thank you, guys. <laughs> come on, you gooners. Subscribe. Oh. Perfect, then.